Hi, I'm Todd Duncan, Senior Editor with the Atlanta Journal-Constitution for Atlanta Classic Cars. I'm sitting inside this beautiful 1960 Chevrolet Corvette at the Creepers Car Club show in Marietta, Georgia. Even though it's raining out here, we've got some tremendous cars that we're going to show you and talk to some of the few folks who love their classic cars. My dad served in the Navy uh, aboard the USS Midway, and he got out of the Navy in 1962 and bought himself a Corvette. Um, so all of the stories when I was a child was dad's hot rod was this 1960 Corvette. And I kind of set that up, I guess, as one of my life goals. If I make it, I'm gonna go get one of those. Well, we came to a good spot. We decided to go ahead and start looking. We found this one. My wife fell in love with it. Uh, and as it turns out, just interesting irony, it's exactly the color combination that my dad had. And all, all the pictures that I had seen, it did not look this color blue. It was very faded, almost a sky color, but it kind of came all together. My parents came to visit, the garage door went up, they walked in and they were both convinced that I had scoured the country and found, found their, their car. Corvette. They didn't quite pull that off. But. Right, right. I got this car when I was in high school. I was 17 years old. I had been saving up my money and uh, caught my mother in to let me buy it. And I drove it for three years and I had so many tickets, so I lost my license. <laughs> and when I got my license back, I parked the car and I didn't drive it anymore until three years ago. Now, where were you driving? Around here? Uh, yes, I graduated right. from Marietta High oh, School. Excellent. So I raced me and my cohort over here with the Firebird, <laughs> my cousin. We raced people all the time. Mm -hmm. That's where we got all the tickets. So tell me about some of the things you've done here. It looks uh, fantastic. I put it back stock like it was original. Mm -hmm. It is a true LS6, mm -hmm. 450 horse Chevelle. Mm -hmm. It's got the uh, Muncie Rock Crusher M22 nice. transmission. Nice. 410 positive track rear end. Well, so how much horsepower? Uh, 450 mm -hmm. horsepower. Very, very nice. So this is a 1957 mm -hmm. Rolls Royce. And it was uh, built for Queen Elizabeth. Really? And when they built it, they kept it for six years. And it's an experimental car. Hmm. So they built, they put the first V8 engine in it, put the first air conditioner in it, right. and put the first electric windows in it. Really? All of the leather on the inside is original, all the carpet is original, all the wood is original. Wow. Very rare. I'm going to live with motor gate bags. That's very cool. Well, how much does this car weigh? Six, uh, 8,800 pounds. Wow. Well, that's a well, big the car. body is made out of a 60,000 stick aluminum mm -hmm. and it's handmade body. Mm -hmm. It is 22 feet long. So it's a light body. With 8,800 pounds. That's a light so body. So when this car was built in 1957, mm -hmm. this was the heaviest and the longest car in the world in 57. Wow. Tell us about this car. This is uh, this was my grandparents' car. I've had it 40 years. And I have something in it that uh, no other car that I know of has that is, is a working car that from the 50s. Yeah, I hear it. That's amazing. And, and I can, if you hold this gun, I can. Mm -hmm. Hey, how are you? Good. Good. Don't forget to bring home milk. <laughs> you said this car has been in the family for how long? Uh, it was my grandparents' car. And when they mm -hmm. passed away, I got it in 1979. Yeah, was it still in this condition, or did you have to do it? I had, I, as soon after I got it, I had it painted. And, uh, and then uh, in the 1990s, I had it painted again. Mm -hmm. And then uh, about five years ago, I had it, it This is how they did it. This okay. is the job they did. And, and what award did you win today? Uh, just, one of, just one of the awards they, they had here. Uh, well, that's pretty cool. Yeah. Okay, well, I wonder if that was for the paint. Yeah. Because it's fantastic. Well, thank you so much. Oh, thank you. And uh, it's going to be a wrap here at the Creepers Car Club show for 2019. Come see us again next year or visit AJC.com slash classic cars to check out our car videos.